And in fifth spot in this race, the Vic Vixens. They are. They were, I think, our um, winners of the Airband competition. So a uh, big round of applause to them. They're newcomers to Victoria looking for community information. And I think we're going to head out to the start of the race, Jerry. And they are off. This race is brought to you by Good Life Fitness. Did you know you can get a free trial pass from Good Life Fitness? You too could be out on the water paddling. Uh, you have a chance to win a trip for two to Punta Cana. A healthier, healthier, happier life is one step away, so be sure to visit they look like Good they're Life Fitness. Really good. Yeah. And the race is underway, ladies and gentlemen. They're digging in and staking out their chunk of the water space this morning. 500 meters from start to finish in just around two minutes. Terry, do you know why dragon boating is often associated with breast cancer survivors? No, but you're going to tell me. Don McKenzie, Canadian sports medicine specialist at UBC, started a dragon boat team for women with a history of breast cancer. He later concluded that the upper body activity and socially supportive environment made a remarkable improvement in women's wellness and post-treatment quality of life. So make sure you start improving your well-being at Good Life Fitness. Remember to have a mammogram, and if you're a guy, buy a carnation today. Make a donation of three bucks and take part in the pink carnation toss after the breast cancer survivors race at noon. And we have another race underway right now. It's race number 41. Okay, I'm with the gorgeous gals, the seraphims, the 18 women, and the island breast strokers, along with the Vixens. Vic this also looks like a very tight race. We've got uh, team number four, which used to be the island breast strokers, just with a slight lead from where we are in our vantage point. Uh, they are working hard to get to the finish line. All those ladies deserve a big cheer from all of you out there who are applauding your teams on. Give them a big push to the finish. Come on, your boat and cheer them on, ladies and gentlemen. Going to be a big finish for this race. Looks like team two, the Seraphins, are working hard. This is going to be a photo finish. And the hey, A-Team and the Seraphins are, it's going to be a photo finish. We cannot tell you who is number one from this vantage point. Going to be we will have to wait apart. for the official the results. Of the second apart in terms of crossing the finish line on that race number 41. Amazing. Amazing job.
Bring some one and two and still play tight. Let's hear it for them, ladies and gentlemen. That was a fantastic race to watch. Don't know where, don't know where 